Hello there ladies and gentlemen, how you doing? It's Alexander Hilly123 here and it's time for a new video and today I'm playing Brian Lara Cricket on the Sega Mega Drive. Now I've just finished making a video about NBA Jam and in that video I said I'm not a big basketball fan but I love this game and in this video I can say I'm not a big cricket fan and I still don't know this game. Unlike NBA Jam, where I love the game even though I don't know the sport too well, I don't know cricket too well uh, to be honest with you and I've only ever heard about this game down the years. I think there was a, a few different Brian Lara's made. One of the Mega Drive, one of the original PlayStation, maybe. One of the PS2 and Xbox 2005, I believe. Um, that's it. We'll play West Indies. May as well. It'd be funny if it, the, the CPU misses out Lara here. Oh, there you go. <laughs> You've got the batting stats there, which is very interesting. You've got a bat and ball, of course. And for me, it might not surprise you, bowling is much more comfortable. <laughs> Batting, you always get knocked out. Not knocked out, you know what I mean. Balled out quickly and that's why I'm electing to field first. Um, and we will choose Darren Goff. Yes, we will. And... Uh, Michael Averton. Michael Everton was a bowler, wasn't he? <laughs> I ain't joking. I can't remember. I don't know. It's 1995, this. So, as you can see, we've placed the marker down. Then you've got to try and get the power right, which isn't easy. Then you keep tapping the A button for the speed. And then you get slogged all over the place. <laughs> Bandry on first ball. Bandry on first ball. And for some reason, a butcher appears. I don't know about that, ladies and gentlemen. Ooh, maximum speed here. I've got deja vu. How about you? Ooh, we just stopped the boundary there. Could have gone for two there, but he only goes for one. Like I was saying, never really played this game before, but I uh, had a little go before I started the video. Oh, here we go. Oh, Slug me again in exactly the same place. I suppose you can't expect ultra realism, but still, I've got to change my game up here, Anna. Let's try and go this. Oh, for God's sake. Very hard with this controller. Let's go a bit slower. Let's deceive him. Kind of worked. They're picking up singles here, West Indies, and they'll be happy with that, I think. I'm not sure how good West Indies were in the mid-90s. They were probably very good. But they had a spell in the doldrums, I believe. I think they're getting better now again. Oh, where the hell's that going? A lot of repetition. Not for everyone, but I think this could be a good time waster, to be perfectly honest. I have a feeling he's going to slog this on the other side. We'll see. Here we go. Medium speed. Oh! Is that. No? Oh, fucking hell. No, that wasn't um, LBW, was it? What the hell's going on here? Okay. Thank you. <laughs> right, now we've got a spinner. Let's entice him here, ladies and gentlemen. Now you're uh, being asked how much spin you want on the ball. We want a lot. I want it medium pace. Making it up as I go along, to be perfectly honest. But I find the sp with spin ball is your best chance of getting them out, to be honest with you. I'd say as well, to be honest with you, balling at least, it's trial and error a lot of times. Ooh, you know, just got back there. I'm going to do another rover, then I'm going to call it a day. Just a little uh, video, of course, a one off video as always. And it would be nice to end it with a wicket, ladies and gentlemen. But it doesn't seem to be forthcoming. <sighs> I'll tell you what, let's try and bounce it there. I want pace on this. And spin. Ah. 
not easy to do. Oh my god, he slogged me the other side. Oh, it's a fuller and the butcher gives us confirmation. I don't know where the hell this ball's gonna go. <laughs> Let's see. When I made the practice video, I did three overs and it was 48 for two. I actually got two wickets. And uh, because it doesn't happen often, you do get a, a sense of satisfaction from actually taking a wicket. But it doesn't seem to be skill, it's just obviously... I mean, that's the way it is, I guess. It's, it seems down to luck. Oh. Well, I said I'd end, end it here, but I think I might continue playing because there is some kind of addictive... Uh, quality this game has got but I'm getting annoyed I'll tell you what we'll have one more go I'm going to put it in front of the wickets like normal well like I'm doing with the power ballers but put less actual power on it and the same thing happens well, I'm not very good at this game, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, maybe there's something I'm missing, I'm not sure. But nevertheless, if you really like cricket, you might be interested in this game. Of course, these days, I think EA made a cricket game about 2004-2005, which I actually played on it, and it was actually really good. But, of course, EA are all about the money. And... I don't believe they may come anymore. Might be wrong. I'm not got a clue to be honest. But nevertheless, there's not too many cricket games knocking about these days. And if you want to play this, uh, do so. Thank you for watching, ladies and gentlemen. I'll see you soon.